Good Tuesday morning. Yes, it is Tuesday. I'm Melissa. You're watching Florida on a Dime. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know you're listening. So, oh my God, you guys. All right, I, wa I got up this morning early. I made a video because I was shipping out stuff. And I did a video of what salt immediately, somehow, accidentally deleted said video. So I said, screw it. And I then watched uh, Lindy Glenn's first time at the outlet uh, video. I very much enjoyed it. And I said, screw it. I said I wasn't going to go to the bins again until Wednesday or Thursday. I dropped off the last kid this morning and it happened to be like 10 minutes before 8. I went to the bins. And oh my God, I bought more than I've ever bought before. I did spend $40, which means I got 20 pounds, which is the most I've ever gotten. And I got some really nice stuff and I'm really excited about it. So I'm gonna get home. Um, I decided instead of, um, instead, well, cause I deleted the video and I've already um, packed the stuff up so I can't show it to you, but I'll do a, like a screenshot of the things that sold. Um, at least you get some sort of idea. I'll talk to you guys later. Hi again. Um, it is 1.40. Um, I was able to go through a little bit of the stuff that I got earlier. Um, while I'm sitting here waiting for my son to get out, he has to get out for another 20 minutes, I'm in the pickup line, I figured I would go ahead and show you all what sold in the past couple of days. Um, like I said, the video went Bye bye I don't know what happened to it. So I just have the screenshot um, of each of the auctions uh, ending prices. Uh, remember those are prices plus shipping. Um, most of the items, except for maybe one or two, which came from the 50 cent Sundays, came from the bin. So not much goes into it. So some nice profit there. Um, a lot of the, a couple of the items, well, a lot of the items. Um, I'd had on fixed auction or I had auctioned a couple times and just wasn't getting any bids So I put them pretty low and a lot of them sold for their starting price and I'm okay with that. That's fine I still made profit. Um, it's going out the door. So no problem with that a couple of them sold for fixed auction buy it now and I think one or two sold um, with best offer I know of one at least um, so here they are. So there you have it. Um, nothing real spectacular, but it all is profit and it adds up and I'm very happy with my results. Um, I have auctions ending tonight and tomorrow. I'll do another what's sold for towards the end of the week. And as for everything I bought today, if I have the time and if I have the time left on this video, I will add um, what I got a haul when I get home. So I will see you then. Bye bye. Hey guys, I'm home. I got everything situated, organized, and I'm going to show you quickly, as fast as I can, what I got. Starting off, I kept finding pieces of these, and some were out, some were in bags, and that's all vintage lace. And I think I measured about 25 yards in all, so I'm gonna sell it as a lot. They seem to do okay, and they weighed next to nothing. And then I got a Spanx tank. Spanx tank. And I got this, it's just apostrophe, but it's plus size. I thought it was really pretty. I don't know if you can see the, the gold flex. And 
and this is a two piece. It's from J. Jill. It's plus size. The top is 4X and then the matching, I think they're called gaucho pants or 3X. And then from Vintage Havana, which is a anthropology brand. It's just this little blouse. It's got the blue on the front and like sheer on the back. Um, I don't buy a lot of maternity, but I saw these. They look brand new, like they were never worn. Uh, they're Liz Lang. They're good size. They're 18 or uh, they call it 18 double double X. I just thought they were in such good condition. I thought they would give them a try. Um, some just basic Nike men's running shorts. Um, I thought this blouse was cute. It's just basic from J. Crew. Some sheer, semi sheer of a blouse. Um, this is a uh, wool and cashmere blend, and it's J. Crew, and it's a dress. I thought it was really pretty. Closer for you. I got this not so much because it sells. I mean, I guess it kind of does. It's called Love Story, L-U-V-S-T-O-R-I. I got it more for the look. I just thought it was so pretty with it's and dainty. Somebody would love to have this. A little flower embroider. It's just a pretty little sleeveless sweater. Back to the plus size. This is Lane Bryant, 26-28, semi-sheer, black. Just a nice shirt. Um, didn't really... I guess I did look it up. Um, I don't know if this kind of skirt... It's new a tag. It's called Kaz, Kaz, K-A-S, New York. It's just a new skirt. That was pretty. Actually, you know what? It's not a skirt. His shorts. How cute is that? Surprised my daughter hasn't tried to steal it yet. Um, this is a just a kid's shirt. It's called Johnny B. It's like uh, Mini Bowden. Um, it's a brand of Mini Bowden. Just a nice little simple shirt, but I saw that they actually sell. Um, I don't know if this will sell. I just had to get it though because I'm a Disney freak. It's an Animal Kingdom uh, bucket hat. It just has the safari animals all around, but it's like mixed in. There's figment mixed in. There's Simba. Mostly. Yeah. Elephants and all different animals. And then there it says Disney's Animal Kingdom. It was cute. Doesn't weigh anything, so. Uh, Torrid. This is a semi sheer uh, size 4 uh, dress. I guess you would call it a dress. This is, again, Wayne Bryant, 2628. It's just a black. Might do well for the holidays. It's got the nice rhinestones on top. Uh, I really love this blouse. I'm actually thinking about keeping it for myself. It's apartment nine. Look how cute it is. It's just the way, I don't know if the pictures are the cameras. It's just got this cross front. It's so pretty and it's this sheer uh, soft material. I might keep that for myself. Uh, Wendy B. Cashmere. It's just a simple, I guess we call it cream color sweater. More Spanx. These ones help me though because they actually have the style name on the tag, so I was able to look it up, um, which will help me sell it better, if my daughter doesn't steal it first. Um, this didn't have a tag on it, it just has a size tag, but then I went down just to look to see if it had an RN number, and sure enough it was Anthropology, and it took a little bit of looking up, um, putting up different things. Actually, it says Anthropology on it. Anyway, it's MAUV, M-A-U-V-E. Um, several of them sold, thankfully, in like the $30 range, so I should get about $30 for this blouse. Uh, Lane Bryant again, this one's eighteen twenty. dollars I thought it was cute with the leopard print, and then it's got little zips 
on the, I guess, the neck area. Um, so I went and didn't find ever, you know, my found my first Lululemons yesterday. And today I was looking at the bags and I saw the familiar Lululemon symbol. So it's just a reusable shopping bag. I picked it up. It doesn't weigh anything. I'm keeping this for me. It's just that Target brand Ava and Viv. It's their plus size. But I've been looking for a black kind of dressy tank everywhere and I just thought this was really pretty. It's got different layers so it's sheer but it's lined at the same time. The back kind of like oh the front does too. How it breaks open it's got the layers. So that's me. I got Victoria's Secret Pink lucky today. It was all in one bin. Obviously this was been on belonged to one owner. And it took me a while to figure out what I was gonna do with them. So I think this is what I'm gonna do. I think first I'm gonna do um, a three lot because these ones don't seem to do as well on their own. But if you put them in like a little lot, it's got love on the front, it's got pink on the back, and this one's blue and then it has a gray one that says the exact same thing. Hello. Pink. And they're both size small, so I was thinking about putting them together. I'm not sure. And put them together with, it doesn't even really match, but it's just like another part of the lot. It's just a pair of pink uh, sweatpants also. You know what, these ones are size extra small. So, I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with these ones yet. But, I was going to sell these ones separately because they're the hoodies that do better. So I've got the blue one. It's got the design on the front. And then the gray one has the exact same design on the front. They're both medium. And then finally I got this that goes, I think, together. I think they were bought together. So it's a set. I'm going to sell it as an outfit. Both the same size, small. So it's got the low pink um, sequins. Really cool. And then here's the pair of pants that match it. That just say love pink on the side. So that's an outfit. Um, these are I just proto polo proto polo P R O T O K O L O sports where I looked them up. The comps are pretty good for them. They're just a pair of athletic pants. Um, Don Caster collection. It's silk. It's really pretty. It's got the ruffles on the front. I'm not sure if you can see. Should do okay. Um, Adidas. I've been, I haven't been paying much attention to Adidas. I didn't know that um, so certain things sold. So these are just a pair of like uh, running capris or I'm not sure how you would call them. They've got little slits in the back. Um, I looked up comps for them. They look okay. So I grabbed them. Even $10, you know. Now this is like the black one that I want to keep, but it's in maroon, and I'm not sure I might keep this one too, we'll have to wait and see. Um, I don't know if this is going to sell, I just got it because it was new with tags, it's XOXO, um, I think JCPenney sells it, and it's just uh, one armed, like got off the shoulder blouse, oh no it's got two, okay so this is like this, and then this is a yeah, full sleeve. My daughter might actually try to steal it from me first, so, or my little sister, if it doesn't sell, so, somebody will get it. And this is Adidas, um, what was it called, Marathon Pen, um, running jacket. I saw one on there for, I think it sold for about 14 so that was good. Um, I got the offer of 500 auctions uh, listing for free between now and the 9th, so I need to get busy, even though I have my kids this week. But I want to take advantage of that because 30 cents, 30 cents, 30 cents, 30 cents all adds up. And to get it for free is for me. So I need to get to work. So please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know you're listening. Bye.